Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Farming for Techies. In today's video, uh, we would like to go over uh, the cucumber plant, uh, what are the things of a cucumber plant and some of the problems that cucumber plants face and how we can uh, uh, optimize it so that we can get some fruit. So here's, I have here four cucumber shrubs as you can see and uh, they, they were very small when I got them and now uh, this is early June and they have good full size, well, uh, sorry not full size but a decent size. Um, so what I have here if you can see closely is if you can focus here there are two female flowers. The female flowers are the one that they have the pod here at the bottom and then there is a flower at the top that needs to get pollinated. So this one over here seems like it's drying off because it didn't get pollinated but this is a, this is a fresh flower that has come in and uh, I, I want to get it pollinated. So one of the common problems with cucumber is that uh, it doesn't get pollinated very often and I'm going to show you a quick tip that will get it pollinated. So apart from the female flower as you can see there's a male flower right over here and this male flower as you can see doesn't have the pod at the bottom and it is more open. It, 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 it is more open than the female flower and that's how you differentiate the male flower from the female flower. So one of the things that you could do is you can have this q-tip this simple q-tip that we can use that we use uh, for clearing our ears or other things so what we can do is that we can just go use the tip just gently go into the male flower and try to just stick on top of the steam to get some pollen from the male flower right here just gently move it around right into that and just make sure that there is some pollen at the top it, it's sometimes not easy to see so just go down there right here yeah and I can see something and then I'm going to go on top of the female flower over here and just going to rub it very gently over here and just sort of drop it just just move it so that the pollen gets dropped on the female flower so this is what you can do if your cucumbers are not getting pollinated and this is a good technique because um, you're basically trying to get it pollinated and, and the female flowers or the male flowers and cucumbers don't have as much smell or aroma as some of the other flowers and that's why the bees don't get attracted over here so this is a good technique and hopefully I'll have a um, follow on video and show you guys that the one, this one that I pollinated hopefully becomes a complete fruit. So until then, thank you. Bye. Um, so today's video is a follow on to the cucumber pollination video we had done uh, exactly 8 days ago and I wanted to provide an uh, update on what happened to that so that you can view the entirety of the process and, and what happened. So. Uh, if you recollect uh, exactly eight days ago uh, I hand pollinated the cucumber uh, the pod that had grown using a male flower and if you see now this is the place where um, uh, I had done the hand pollination and if you see closely here is the cucumber so right here this is the one that has gotten pollinated right here this is the entire cucumber so it's exactly it is it's not full size yet so I'm not taking it out from I'm not harvesting it just yet but this was the same place that we pollinated eight days ago and it has become a fruit now. Uh, so this is one of the uh, things that uh, hand pollination does help in cases. Now there are two other uh, that you can see that I have not hand pollinated but they have gotten pollinated. So one is right here, this one, another one. I did not hand pollinate this so it happened uh, using the usual pollination whether it's for wind or insects or flies I, I, or, or uh, bees I don't know. And then there is another one right here. Uh, can find it uh, it's somewhere right here there's, there's a third one that is that is also got pollinated um, so anyway so there are three of them um, and the good news is that they can get pollinated uh, if there are enough flowers. so today I have a situation where you can see there are multiple female uh, male flowers over here but I don't have any active female pod at the moment uh, so <clears throat> there are a few of them like you can see over here this one has dried out right here uh, it didn't get pollinated but there are several of them that do get pollinated and I have some new ones coming here in the next few days so hopefully these can get pollinated using the male flowers I have over here so this is another male flower there's another one down here and so that, that oh yeah here is the third one here is the third cucumber as you can see so it is, it is not full size yet obviously but it did get pollinated so that's the thing about cucumbers as you can see I have like three or four um, small cucumbers now which are pollinated a few of them dried out and then few new pots coming and few male flowers are there and hopefully they can get pollinated so thanks for watching and if you do like this video please like it please subscribe to my channel and click that notification icon so that you can you know that i have a new uh, video coming up